This is our heel elevated goblet squat with a close stance. So what I'm gonna have Susan do is grab her dumbbell and she's gonna put her heels onto this plate for me. So this is a 25 pound plate. It's about, to, about an inch and a half thick. You can certainly go higher, you could go lower. Before she even squats, I'll give you the reasons why we do this. One, by having the heels elevated, it lets us take the ankle range of motion out of the equation. So Susan's gonna be able to get to a really deep depth. She's gonna be able to get her hips below her knees, which puts the quad, the, the quad, the knee joint into deep flexion. It's really gonna let us target the middle quad muscle. That's also why it is that our close stance is because we're really trying to hit rectus femoris more so than the outer quad. As we go wider, we get more outer quad. As we go narrower, we get mid and coming even, even a little bit to inner. I know for me, this lights up adductors to a degree as well. So the squat is as it usually is. She's gonna initiate with butt going back, but then she's gonna pull her butt straight down like she's sliding down a wall. Let's go for like five. There we go. Good. And Susan, you're dipping a little bit forward at the chest, so keep it, think about keeping your shoulders back, proud chest. There we go. Let's get three more like that. All right, thank you, Susan. Guys, that is our close stance heel elevated goblet squat. Again, we do this because it lets us light up rectus femoris, the middle quad, and with heel is elevated so we can get to full depth. If for some reason you can't get to full depth, don't worry about how far down you go, but try to be consistent with it with every rep, and over time, see if you can go a little bit further. The last thing I'll say about Susan's technique here, she did a great job of maintaining tension all the way through. It was really smooth, there was no bounce out of the bottom, she wasn't falling into the hole. That's what it should look like. Quad should be working the whole time. And you know, we can predict that 20 of these is gonna make your, make your quads nice and loud. Thanks.